From Ellie may be over, but more snow could be on the way. Can you believe it? And lately, the snow days are piling up in cities and towns across Connecticut. And less time in school means less time learning. So how are students and teachers staying top of their curriculum when classes are canceled? We sent Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Jill Kanopka to Platt High School in Meriden to find out. She's live in the Silver City right now with that story. Jill. Well, Dennis, students here in Meriden had yet another snow day yesterday, their third Monday in a row. Luckily, all 1,100 students here are either issued a tablet or an iPad so they can get their work done from home when snowstorms shut school down. I love them, to what? be honest. Snow days have canceled classes five times this year for students. So you want to make sure that you are viewing the PowerPoint. You get and teachers here at Platt High School in Meriden. It's missed class time. Um, it's missed direct instruction time. Uh, fortunately, with our use of technology, we're able to uh, uh, feel a little better about that, a little less stress. I like it, but at the same time don't like it. Because we would have to make up the school days, but I like it because we don't miss any work. But thanks to technology, they're able to keep up at home. And not just for snow days, though it definitely helps Mother Nature shut school down. Students simply log in online from home. Go into economics, click on Chapter 2 Bookwork, and Mr. Corsetti made a video. We listen to it, and then we go back and click on the article. Economics teacher Dan Corsetti knew Friday there was a chance for no school come Monday. I said, you know, make sure we check Moodle in case we're not here Monday. And, and so when I got in today, I was able to see the book work um, that, you know, some of them had started and, you know, that they had questions and things like that. Students say this method works. We will have to make up the school days, but we would never fall behind them academically. So when you got into the classroom today, did you feel ready to go? Yes. And for delays like today, Meriden math teacher Kurt Regis helped create a condensed school schedule. It just allows us to, to meet all the students on days that we have a delay when instead of dropping classes or, or not knowing. And now the district can add up to five snow days onto the end of the academic calendar. After that, they'll take days away from the uh, April vacation, the back end of April vacation. For now, reporting live with the Mobile Newsroom here in Meriden tonight, Jill Kanopka, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.